Win Every Argument is a book written by Mehdi Hassan, a British journalist, broadcaster, and political commentator. The book focuses on the art of debating and arguing effectively, providing readers with practical tips and strategies to win any argument they engage in. The book is divided into 10 chapters, each covering a different aspect of the art of argumentation. Chapter 1. Winning is not everything in this chapter. Hassan emphasizes the importance of recognizing that winning an argument is not the most important thing. Instead, the goal should be to have a constructive conversation that leads to a better understanding of each other's views. Hassan encourages readers to approach arguments with an open mind, be willing to listen to other perspectives, and learn from them. Chapter 2. Master the Art of Listening In this chapter, Hassan emphasizes the importance of listening as a key component of effective argumentation. He advises readers to actively listen to the other person, understand their perspective, and acknowledge their concerns. By doing so, readers can build trust and credibility with their opponents, leading to a more productive conversation. Chapter 3. Know Your Enemy In this chapter, Hassan advises readers to research and understand their opponents' arguments, beliefs, and values. He encourages readers to anticipate their opponents' objections and prepare counter-arguments to address them effectively. Chapter 4. Choose Your Battles In this chapter, Hassan advises readers to choose their battles wisely, focusing on issues that matter to them and where they can make a meaningful impact. He encourages readers to avoid getting into arguments that are unlikely to change anyone's mind or that are not worth the effort. Chapter 5. Pick Your Words Carefully In this chapter, Hassan emphasizes the importance of choosing the right words and phrases to convey the intended message effectively. He advises readers to avoid using inflammatory language, personal attacks, and logical fallacies. Chapter 6. Use Data and Evidence In this chapter, Hassan advises readers to use data and evidence to support their arguments. He encourages readers to research and cite credible sources and statistics to back up their claims effectively. Chapter 7. Stay calm and collected in this chapter. Hassan advises readers to remain calm and collected during arguments. He emphasizes the importance of controlling emotions, avoiding defensiveness, and responding to arguments with logic and reason. Chapter 8. Know your own limits in this chapter. Hassan advises readers to recognize their own limits and weaknesses. He encourages readers to be humble, acknowledge when they are wrong, and be willing to change their views based on new evidence. Chapter 9. Respect your opponent in this chapter. Hassan emphasizes the importance of respecting one's opponent, even when disagreeing with them. He advises readers to avoid personal attacks, listen to opposing views, and acknowledge their opponent's right to hold their own opinions. Chapter 10. Practice makes perfect in this chapter. Hassan advises readers to practice arguing effectively by engaging in debates, attending public speaking events, and reading about argumentation. He encourages readers to seek feedback and learn from their mistakes to improve their skills. Keynotes. 1. Winning an argument should not be the primary goal, but rather having a constructive conversation to understand each other's views. 2. Active listening is a key component of effective argumentation, as it helps build trust and credibility with opponents. 3. Researching and understanding opponents' arguments, beliefs, and values is crucial to preparing counter-arguments. 4. Choosing the right battles to engage in is essential to focusing on issues that matter and can make a meaningful impact. 5. Choosing words carefully, avoiding inflammatory language and logical fallacies, is important to convey the intended message effectively. 6. Using credible data and evidence to support arguments can strengthen one's position. 7. Remaining calm and collected during arguments is crucial to responding with logic and reason. 8. Acknowledging one's limits and weaknesses is important to being humble and willing to change one's views based on new evidence. 9. Respecting one's opponent, even when disagreeing with them, is essential to avoiding personal attacks and acknowledging differing opinions. 10. Being aware of cognitive biases and avoiding them can improve argumentation skills. 11. Identifying common ground and building on it can lead to more productive and constructive conversations. 12. Being open to changing one's own views based on evidence and reasoning can lead to a more constructive dialogue. 13. 
Using analogies and metaphors can help make complex ideas more accessible to opponents. 14. Avoiding stereotypes and assumptions about opponents can help build a more productive conversation. 15. Understanding the power dynamics of an argument can help address potential biases and level the playing field. Overall, Win Every Argument is a useful guide for anyone looking to improve their argumentation skills. By emphasizing the importance of listening, understanding one's opponent, choosing the right words, using data and evidence, staying calm and collected, and practicing one's skills, Hassan provides readers with practical strategies for winning arguments effectively and constructively.